I think the band is, uh, I, I, I really like, appreciate the, the founder of the band, John D. Chu. He basically, you know, has the ideas, basically, you know, build the band from scratch. This is, a, he, this is a four, he has a four bands. So he, we have, uh, as, we, as I mentioned, we have 70 concerts annually. We will do basically, you know, present, play for all the uh, communities like uh, the uh, senior centers, uh, bus stations, or like uh, for the annual kind of festivals, uh, like Chinese festivals, India festivals, or also American, and like uh, New Year, Christmas, we are celebrated. Bring all whole, the whole communities, all the people. Uh, we invite the city officials or the local people to enjoy shows, to basically have the chance to, to understand each other's culture. Beats, fast colors and promises how to be we have different brave. kind of music from India, China, uh, American music. So understand the cultures, get together, you know, that's basically I think it's a very good chance opportunities. It's really great to hear youth performing. Uh, to begin with, cover music, because I think it's important to learn the classics. And then when you hear that they're doing songs like uh, a Beatles song or a Elton John song, that's really hard to do. You can see that they're, they're uh, making their craft better you know, each time. So it's always a pleasure to see youth performers. Um, I am uh, Johnny Q. I'm the composer and director at Eternity Band. Uh, I try to over the years try to ma try many. I help many people try to start new bands like ours because I like to see kids getting groups and and do what they like to uh, play what they like. Uh, unfortunately, it's pretty hard to do. Um, and we are the only one that, that I know in the Bay Area does what we do. So um, we we give people the the opportunity to play what they like, and uh, we write score according to their skills. Um, so if if your score is too hard, then people might give up. And also um, we have so many um, performance opportunities uh, for our band member, and we also share the opportunity with the community. This is what I say, <laughs> what's special about us. Uh, my name is Jesse and I play the Chinese traditional instrument, Wu Zhen. Today we'll be bringing to you guys five pieces. Um, basically, there will be about like five people playing Wu Zhen and like one person playing the Hu Yu Su. Yeah. I feel like I just really like playing this instrument. It's fun to listen to and it's fun to learn and it's really enjoyable for me. I feel like it's just very good band that just really brings a lot to the community. It's very, um, it helps a lot of people. Yeah. I'm a member of Audacity 21 and I'm also a part of Eternity Band and Color Vision. Um, Audacity 21 is the James Logan uh, band part of Eternity Band. I, I think the most unique part of it is that Eternity Band is a completely like student-run volunteer band and also that we pick our own songs. So it's basically a democratic vote and whatever we want to play, it goes, I guess. Oh, it's, it's good to see the kids out here, you know, practicing their talent, things that they like to do. This is beautiful music, dude. This really is. Uh, 
It's always a pleasure to see youth performers. Uh, I've been doing live music production for about 30 years, and a lot of the youth performers end up being adults on my stages, so it's great. All three of the bands that we've seen today are great. I love seeing the real young performers because it really gives me hope. Um, sometimes when you're in my position, creating big shows and producing stuff, you forget that it takes like a young artist whose passion is the same like when I was a kid. I've been making music since I was probably 14 or 15 years old. And if somebody didn't do what this group is doing, for me, I would never still be in the music industry today. And so I've been in every part of it. I've made uh, 50 albums. I, I owned a record label for many years. I own a distribution and marketing company. So I distribute digital, physical, licensing, all of those things. I've composed about 350 songs. So again, I have this direct relationship, but quite quite honestly, to see this is, is amazing. It makes me feel like there's hope in the future. Just us right now, nothing that I wanna tell you about